Well, this last year has been a whirlwind for so many reasons and students across the country and across the world have had to overcome obstacle after obstacle to succeed. That's right. In this morning's great graduate segment, we are introducing you to Rodney Hunter of St. Mary's Hall, who continues to thrive. It's been difficult, been really weird. Meet Rodney, a star on and off the basketball court. But this past year with everything going on has really tested his tenacity and his perseverance. It's difficult to watch, you know, because of it's been going on for so many years, but it, it, it really hit home because, you know, my parents, um, their parents, and they've all seen similar stuff like this. And it, it, um, it really affected me because of how my parents thought about it. When Rodney isn't focused on his game, his grades, or his time with St. Mary's Hall Investing Club, he's working to help out others. I'm blessed, and a lot of people don't have what I have. So I always like to, to, to do my best to give back to the people who are, you know, not as blessed as me. Part of what inspires him is his family, specifically his mother. She is now the CEO of San Ministries, a nonprofit here in San Antonio, but it wasn't always like that. And his family is what pushes him to be better. I'm the oldest sibling, so it puts pressure on me to, you know, be the example for my three younger ones, you know. I want them to be better than what I am, so I have to show them what it takes to be better than what I am. Rodney continues to set the bar high. He is set to take his talents to Kerrville. Next year, I am gonna attend Shriner University. Um, I'm gonna play basketball and major in data analytics. And big shout out to Rodney. I mean, he could not miss when we were shooting around. He was wearing loafers and he hit like seven of seven three. It was talent right there. <laughs> very impressive. But he also tells me as far as his future goes, he loves math. He is looking at forensic accounting and data analytics. 